welcome back to my channel if you're new here. Why do you say no? Why do you always talk to yourself? I don't like it. So you have to tell yourself no? Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Courtney if you're new here and if you're already subscribed, welcome back. I'm with my twin sister Katie and we're doing a twin car tour. I'm in my car right now. Her car is parked next to me. Let's see if you can see it. And we both have Volkswagen Beetles. Yes, we're both twins and for our 18th birthday we each got our own car. That's kind of like what our grandma promised us. We both got Volkswagen Beetles, which is really funny. I think it's kind of cool because we're twins and we also got the same car, just different colors. So we're gonna be doing a 2018 car tour. I'm scared. FYI, we are not bragging. I used to watch car tours. FYI, we are bragging. <laughs> we are not trying to brag. This Trust is just me. a car tour. No need to think we're bragging. <laughs> I know. I don't want to ramble on too much, but I will say if you want to follow us on Instagram, it will be linked down below. Follow me on Doe. I'm doing giveaways over there. I'm now a Doe girl, not to brag or anything. Mighty brag. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoy and this is all just for fun. Maybe some of you watching right now are curious about Volkswagen Beetles. Maybe you want one for your car. Actually, they're not making them anymore, so sorry. Wait, yeah. Let's just get started into this car tour. Enjoy. Vegan. So this is my car. This is a 2017 Volkswagen Beetle and I actually bought it for new, which is pretty cool. You don't really find that a lot and I got it for the price of a used car. So I got a really good deal on this and that's why I chose this one. This car is so cute. I'm obsessed with it and I, I still can't believe I own this car like it's so crazy to me so here is my car I named her Lola here is my steering wheel and over here it just has like this elastic thing where you can put like your water bottle and the only thing I don't like about this is this is a place where most people like to throw their trash but with my car there's really nowhere to put it here is where you control your windows um, the locks and this is where you can adjust your mirrors. This is a really nice car I have black interior all throughout my car. My car is black on the outside It has Bluetooth so you can like play your music and talk on the phone And then there's just that and this is where you can control your lights. Okay, I have to turn on the car It's way too hot. This is where you control your blinkers and then this is your windshield wipers if you're curious what the horn sounds like, I'll show you guys, but there's someone next to me, so I'm really scared to do this, but I'm gonna do it anyway. So that's what it sounds like. Moving on up here, I like how it has this little thing where you can throw stuff on. Like usually when I go to the gas station or like I'm in a hurry, I'll just throw my wallet or sunglasses. Actually, at the moment, I have this Michael Jackson DVD, so love that. Actually, here's the CD player right now, which is really nice. You just throw it in there and it goes in here's my center console and the air in this car blows really well i'll show you it's just your controllers with the air conditioning this is your hazard lights i think these buttons right here are actually useless i think my car compared to katie's it's not the most advanced like mine is just a basic car there's not really much added stuff to it but hers like these buttons the, she actually does have like buttons that mean something Usually I like to put my phone in there and at the moment I also have this cinnamon broomstick that smells so good. I got this from Trader Joe's for 99 cents. Highly recommend. There's also a USB plug in there and that is what connects like the aux cord, you know. Here is my gear shifter. Is that what you call it? I don't even know. Here's my emergency brake and then I have two cup holders. So moving back up here, the radio and like the sound system in this car is really good compared to the car I was driving before, which was a Kia Soul. Wow, like I couldn't believe how how good the sound sounded moving on we have this little armrest right here and you can open it up and it's actually like a little storage unit thing which it's not big at all right now I just have this perfume I have gum sunglasses lip balm this also lifts up and down here I just keep like my change and there's just another little storage thing and this just like moves up and down which is nice so yeah it goes that far but sometimes it's hard to like get it to where it needs to be why is it not stopping oh my gosh okay forget that and here's the other passenger chair these chairs are actually really comfortable too so here is another like console thing and inside i just keep like random stuff ah! um hey guys what's up make sure to like and subscribe okay so on this side something that i really really like about this car is that it says 
Beetle right here and it doesn't say that in Katie's car before I bought this I thought it was gonna have another like storage thing which you'll see in Katie's car it does I was expecting to get it and I didn't get it but Katie's does not say Beetle so I like that mine says Beetle oh my gosh I almost forgot the top area here is my little mirror hey guys I have my garage opener and then up here you can control the lights and then up here something I also like is that it has like the sunglass holder so I just have sunglasses and I can fit like two in here and I think that's basically it for the front of the car nor my ugly feet probably gonna blur it out I love how it says beetle on the floor mat so let's just move on to the back of the car so if you can't tell the beetle only has two doors so in order to get in the back um, it has this little handle thing that you pull up and then the seat moves like this and you can actually like roll it so people have room to get in the back and at the moment I have this red sweater and a ghost potato chip from Trader Joe's so surprisingly the back seats it's actually really spacious like you would think in the Beetle it's tight which it probably would be if you're like super tall but for the most part you have so much room back here and you don't feel cramped in here over here we have this thing I don't know what that's called but you can charge your phone we have a cup holder which this is so small but yeah you can fit two people back here super spacious in my opinion who it is so hot but I do not have a problem with riding back here at all it's so comfortable oh also in the back seats there is an armrest and then there's another little storage thing over here which is not big and it has them on each side so now moving on to the trunk um, I also forgot to mention that this car does have a camera so when you back out a camera like pops up but you can't see it from here. So basically all you have to do is push this in. Oh, also it says turbo right here, which I like a lot. And you lift it up. And here's the trunk. It's actually like pretty big, I guess. Like just to show you how big it is, this is how big it is. But this trunk can't even fit a boogie board. Like if you're going to the beach, I tried to fit my boogie board in here and it didn't even fit. So it is kind of small. But the seats go down, so... Honestly, am I okay? It's my turn to do a car tour. So I have the 2016 Volkswagen Dune Beetle, which is a line part of the Doodle... I'm dyslexic! Yeah, mine's different because it's the Dune line. It's still a Beetle, but it's just a different line. And I bought it used. It had 10,000 miles on it from the previous owner. And whoever bought this got the package deal, which came with more accessories and features, which is really cool. So mine's a little more upgraded than Courtney's, and hers is the 2017 or 18. So mine's 2016. So it's a little different. Pretty sure we have the same engines. Not totally sure. So to start off, this is the view from the driver's seat. And what I love about the Dune Beetle is the yellow stitching. Okay. Hello? What I love about the Dune line is the yellow stitching that they incorporated into this car. I love yellow. It's one of my favorite colors. It's a more sporty looking beetle and I just love that. I've always wanted a beetle since I was in first grade. And yeah, so this is the view from the driver's seat. I love the Dune logo right here. So this is kind of similar to Courtney's. I just have more upgraded features. So over here, it's a little cubby. That's not a cubby, delete that. So this is to adjust the side mirrors, headlights, and then to change the color of the lights around my car. And then down here, I also put in LED lights, which look like this. I got those from Amazon. I think they were like $30 and I installed them. So part of my upgrade, it came with updated like buttons, I guess. So this is a more updated one and it's electronic and yeah, it's not like Courtney's. Also, the screen is upgraded too. It has Apple CarPlay. It's really cool because it shows your iPhone screen. And over here I have my car diffuser from Earthbound. And here I just keep um, an essential oil blend which I put into my diffuser, it's citrus. Hand sanitizer, lipstick, lip gloss. I have this remote that changes the lights down here that I put in to all these colors. I keep it on this purple bluish one though because I love that one. So over here, Courtney actually doesn't have this feature. 
this pulls out and it's a little storage unit which literally fits nothing it like isn't even deep if you can't tell i have a bag of nuts in here lotion and tons of chopstick because i love chopstick this is the same as hers i just keep a lot of napkins and makeup remover wipes and now for my most favorite part are the seats i love the design on them and of course the yellow stitching it just looks very sporty and it's cloth but it's cool because this outside part is leather and so is the head and then back here i have some jackets and my work bag and my friend's shirt also this is to turn on and off the lights as you can see they're off now they're on so i realized i completely forgot to film an outro to this video so this is what this is i can't believe i'm just now posting this and it's december i literally filmed this video like two months ago and we got our cars in july so not sure why it took me so long but at least it's posted now so yeah that is our vw beetle 2018 car tour i was re-watching the video and i realized it's kind of shaky and like it's not really focused. I don't know. I feel like it's really hard to film car tours, but I still hope that we got the footage. And if you're looking to buy a Volkswagen Beetle, literally, I, it's the best car. Even after four months, I still can't believe I own this car. Like, this car is such a nice car. And if you are looking to buy one, it's such a good car. I actually highly recommend it. And I'm so sad that they're, they stopped making them. But I have a feeling in the future they will, like, remake them again. I feel like they're just taking a break now, you know? And if you have questions, make sure to leave them down below. I would be happy to help you. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not already. And like this video. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!